Hello guys, hope you are feeling okay. You are watching Microsoft Office Learning. Today I'm going to show you how can we use concatenate formula in Microsoft Excel. How can we use concatenate function in Excel? First I will tell you the purpose of this formula. The purpose of this formula is to merge two cells, to merge the information of the two cells. Sometimes we came across the situation we need to merge the two cells to get our results. I created the example here. So here there is a first name column, this is a last name column and this is a full name column. Suppose we only have the two columns, the first name and the last name, but we want to see the full name in one cell. Here the concatenate function will help us. So let's start writing the formula is equal to C O M. It comes up the first if I press tab, so it will select it. So it requires the cell reference of very first cell then comma and the second cell reference and then close of brackets and press enter so it will merge the first name and the last name you can see Alex and John it merge the both of the name first name and the last name in in one cell which is Alex John so it has merged the name if I want to copy this formula I just simply double click on bottom and it will copy for the all of the cells it has merged all the cells all the first name and the last name so but here there is a problem there is no space between the first name and the last name it's not the presentable if I want to make it more presentable I'll, I'll add the space between the first name and the last name so how can I add the space so what I will do if I press F2 it will edit the formula so after the comma I will add in quotation and then space in quotation again and comma again so what it will do it will add the space between two names we need to add space with the help of in quotation so now if I press enter so it will add the space between the first name and the last name. Again, if you want to copy this formula, simply double click on it. So it will copy down all of the cells. Now the first name and the last name, they are coming with this space. It is more presentable. Here, I wrote down the formula for you ease guys. Is equal to concatenate, start of bracket, G8, comma, H8 and the close of bracket. If I want to merge the cell without spaces, then we use this. If I want to merge the cell with spaces between these two cells, then start of the cell reference comma in quotation space. Make sure to give space between in quotations and comma and the last cell reference. So here down is another example, kind of numeric example. If I want to add Sorry, if I want to merge these two cells, what I will do, start, concatenate, it will come first, press tab, and then first cell reference, comma, second cell reference, close of bracket, press enter. So it will merge all the information without spaces. Again, if I want to copy it, so I'll simply press double click, and it will copy for all the cells. So now I want to show you the formula in another perspective. So I'm deleting the, this information for the time being. So we can merge these two cells with AND function as well. How it works is equal to first cell reference and then AND sign. This is the AND sign and then second cell reference. If I press enter, it will give me the same result. It gives me the same result like it gives in concatenate function. So I'll drag this result and it will give me the same output as the concatenate function gives me. The difference between this AND and the concatenate function is that AND function works without spaces and concatenate function with spaces. So I have shown you to merge the cell with both perspective one from the concatenate and second one from the AND function so i hope so you like this video make sure to like this video and subscribe this channel 
and press the bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming video. I see you guys in next video.